curry favor now by by showing how unafraid he is to, to call. <laughs> <laughs> Is this the modern day Howard Cosell, Muhammad Ali, or something like that? Oh. Hannah and Manfred. I love press conferences. I said, I said when I was, I was texting with uh, the producer that uh, I think I'm the only person who press conferences are my favorite part of this job, and that's not a good brag because it's, <laughs> it's not the best part of the job to be great at. But I really do, I really do enjoy it, and I don't even mind. Manfred's attempts to weasel out of questions because I think they are often so telling. I've said about him be before that my favorite thing about Rob Manfred is that he doesn't suffer fools. And my least favorite thing about him is that he thinks we are all fools, but that can be used to our advantage. He loves to condescendingly explain things. And often he is very revelatory in the way that he does that. Yeah, and the shot at A's fans and then coming afterward, I was taken out of context. Actually, the correct word was just sorry. That That's it. Yes. That would have solved a lot. Apologized. Never, yes. ever apologizes for anything. Maybe a look back at the Astros thing a million years later, but no apologies okay. ever. The word sorry does not exist. If you put him under oath mm -hmm. um, for multiple questions, what would you ask? Okay. I have a list. Should I just run through the list? Yes, oh, please. Yes. <laughs> wow. Yes. I love lists. All right. All right. What was the behind the scenes reaction from big market owners uh, about the way that John Fisher has gone about engineering his departure from Oakland? I would love to know what the Yankees, Steve Cohen. Owners, well, I know uh, the other owners love John Fisher. As a person, not what he's doing to the I know yeah, that I've, They can't be mad. They got to be other owners. Mad. Other owners, they like John Fisher. I'm just saying. Um, did you know or how much did you know about the Astros cheating before the Athletics report? Because we know they have said that teams teams are always accusing each other of cheating. But teams were accusing the Astros of cheating. How did they look into it and not find this? Or did they? Hmm. All right. Number three, uh, how worried are you about the post-RSN finances for team and teams and the league hmm. as a whole? That's just because I want to be prepared. Uh, was the league specifically <laughs> targeting Max Scherzer with the sticky stuff? Yes. All right. Yes, after he uh, came on here and he talked about it, two days later he got whacked. So yes. absolutely, 100% yes. they got him. Yes. He was on here they, two days before the exact scenario, and then two days he pitches, and oh, yeah, by the way, you're you're gone. They have said in press conference settings when asked about it that they don't think they have caught all of the pitchers who are using. Of course not. That We've seen the, the spin rates. But if that's the case, you got to explain the few pitchers who are getting punished. How is that process of selection happening? All right. Uh, what was the biggest mess that Bud Selig left for you to clean up? Mm. I to know that. That's and uh, what's the, just what's the craziest piece of intra-owner goss? I want to know, like, who has like a the most dangerous game island? Who's who? Who hates who? <laughs> I just want to know about the owners. We know so little about the owners, and they have such an impact on the game. I I can't agree more, Hannah. I am more fat. I always say this. Right? I'm so fascinated yes. by each owner because they impact our sport more than owners impact other sports. Because there's Absolutely. a salary cap. You can run your team how you want. It's wild west. Some of them are weird and don't talk. Some of them, when they do talk, it's a walking soundbite. I, I can't agree more. So, And next time we'll do this game again, and AJ did it for one, AJ will just answer each time because oh, he's yeah. got an answer. <laughs> right? Rob and I are like this. Yeah, <laughs> but, but you have your own opinion. It's great. So we'll, we'll dress you up as, as Rob in a suit next time. Yeah, and, you, and you have to start all of your answers with, look. Oh, that is so irritating to me, Hannah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, don't start. And if you me. say sorry, you're fired. Hannah, it was awesome <laughs> having you. Um, you can follow her at Hannah R. Kaiser. Uh, read her articles in Yahoo Sports. Bandwagon, as you can see behind her, the pod. We'll listen to it later. And uh, really appreciate you coming on, and we'd love to have you back.